Welcome to Six's Overdrive. Today, I'm going for a ride. Not on this motorbike, but on the pedal bike. Hey, it's going to be a little bit of a different video this time. Probably not going to be too much in the way of motorcycles. I'm going to meet my family out at Sundry, called a place called Bear, Bearberry Cabins. So it's our kind of annual family camping trip, and we're going to go out and meet them, and I'll get some footage of that for you guys. Listen, guys, it's not you, it's me. This is just something I have to do. I know, I know. It's a whole weekend and it's supposed to be plus 32 this weekend. But what do you want me to do about it? I have to go. It's a yearly trip. I'll be back though. I'll be back on Monday, I swear. Well, 10 o'clock in the morning and we are just about ready to go. But it wasn't without a challenge. I'm pooped. We had to load up this whole car, you know, with three boys going to a campsite, campfires, axes, playground toys, whatever else. And plus a son that needs a special stroller and a uh, special bed. This thing is packed to the nines. Got the family some Mary Browns. You don't have that in the States except for maybe one store in Florida, but I'm looking forward to this. Some yummy deep fried chicken. <laughs> All in all, the Sundry area is very nice. It's very scenic. Hills rolling all over the place. Beautiful big trees, spruce, and it's really nice. Got to go to the lake a little bit, have some fun, play some spike ball with my family, with my brothers. I had a great time. It was, it was pretty packed in the cabins, let me tell you, but our cabins were only $100 a night. The disappointing part is, if you're more than two people, in these little cabins that we rented you're gonna want to go upgrade a little bit to the bigger cabins that you see in some of the footage because really <laughs> they're they're fairly tiny they're big for two people but for a family of five like i have and then the height of it is a total catastrophe so don't count on the extra space if you brought a couple extra sleeping bags and some mattresses or something like that you could easily fit four people or five people in here um, and it's only a hundred bucks a night, but you know, the fact that they have a hide bed that looks like this. Is not the coolest thing in the world. I mean, a piece of junk, really. My son was sleeping on it and, uh, let me adjust this. My son was sleeping on it and he kept falling, the thing kept collapsing. It was really a hazard. Uh, the mattress on it was from like 1959. The thing is rotted right out. Just gross. Uh, but everything else around here has been pretty darn good. Um, just a beautiful area, beautiful scenery, and a good place if you got a group of family that wants to get together and do something. It's really good. guys this is Sixes Overdrive and uh, I've had a great time making these videos for you so if you want to I'd appreciate it if you share like comment and subscribed and hit the little bell button so you get notifications other than that this is Sixes Overdrive from Bearberry Cabins up near Sundry Alberta and uh, I'm saying bye bye mm -hmm.